Nah. Hey guys, it's Jalisha and I'm back with another video. Thank you so much for tuning in. This video is going to be on this eye look here. I wore this to the Beyonce Formation Tour and so many people liked it when I posted it on Snapchat. Follow me on Snapchat. <laughs> um, but yeah, so many people liked it so I just decided to recreate the look. Um, I didn't do it exactly how I did it that day because I honestly don't remember the exact steps I took to get the look but um I tried my best <laughs> honestly you guys whenever I do my makeup especially eyeshadow I just wing it I have no idea what I'm doing so yeah I'm not a makeup artist or anything of that nature I honestly just do this for fun um but I think that's pretty much it so yeah until then I hope you guys like this video and just keep watching so everything's done i've done my foundation brows concealer all of that off camera um i'm just gonna go right into eyeshadow my lids are already primed i just used my concealer and used my setting powder to set everything so you can do that or you can use your favorite eye primer whichever works for you so the first color i'm going to use is soft brown and this palette that i created from mac so this is soft brown and i'm going to put this in my transition area and i'm going to be using a mac 224 brush for this it's going to give the other shadows something to blend into this color doesn't have to be perfect honestly next I'm going to take my Velvet 59 Exotic Lotus Palette, um, which I absolutely love. Uh, the palette looks like this. It is super duper pretty and the pigmentation in the shadows are amazing. And I want to take this color called Coyote Com Am I saying that right? Kyoto Kimono. Um, and this color here is like a dusty pink color almost it's like a pink with a little bit of purple it's hard to explain but I'm going to take that color and I'm going to put that on a MAC 217 brush and I'm going to put this directly into my crease and I'm just going to keep building this color I'm going to go back with that 224 brush and um, a little bit of soft brown, not a lot. It looks like you're being punched in the eye right now. Don't give up. Now I'm going to take um, my palette again from MAC in the shade Swiss Chocolate, which is this here. And I'm going to take the same 217 brush and put that into my crease as well. Now we're going to jump into the shade On The Night by NYX. It's like a gray with a purple undertone or purple undertone with a gray. It's really hard to describe but I want to take this and use an e.l.f. crease brush. I love this brush. It's perfect for the crease. I'm sort of packing it onto the outer corner and then um, dragging it into the crease slowly. I'm going to put this in the inner corner as well, leaving a space in the middle. And I'm using the very tip of the brush to blend, like the very tip. I'm going to take that 217 brush into soft brown and Swiss chocolate. I'm going to mix the two. Now I'm sort of using whatever's left on that brush we used to apply on the night with. I'm going to sort of connect. So now I'm going to take this NYX color, it's one of their primal colors in the shade Hot Black, which is amazing by the way. And I want to take this on a pencil brush, this is the MAC 210 brush. What I want to do with that color, I'm going to start packing that on the outer, on the very outer and in the very inner corner of my eyes. Strictly using it to place the color. 
This is one of the blackest blacks that you can find in drugstore um, cosmetics. Make sure you're tapping your brush so that way you don't get as much fallout with this color. And I'm going to take the same brush we used with that on the night color, the um, elf crease brush, and I'm going to slowly blend it out. You don't want to use the entire brush because then it will get messy. So you just want to use the tip just to keep it really concentrated. I'm going to take a little bit of that on the night color just to help it blend out as well. So I want to take on that crease brush a little bit more of the on the night shadow just because I feel as though we're losing a little in the crease. I'm going to take a clean um, blending brush and I'm going to take the color Orb which is this cream off white shade. Now moving on to the center of our lids, I'm going to take Max Mixing Medium. I love this stuff. Now I'm going to take my Velvet 59 palette again, and I'm going to take this shade here called Princess of China. Love this shade. And I'm going to take that on a Mac 239 flat brush. Now moving on to the lower lash line, soft brown, and squish chocolate. So now I'm going to take this NYX, I'm mean not NYX, this Rimmel Scandal Eye Cool. It's in the shade Nude. I'm going to take the On The Night color, and I'm going to take this shading brush from Real Techniques and put that under my, on my lash line. Now I'm going to take this e.l.f eyeliner and shadow stick. I'm going to take the liner side. It's in the black. And I'm going to put this on my lash line. Leaving the middle blank. So I'm going to take this e.l.f smudge brush. I love it. And I'm going to take that black shadow and pack it right over the black liner. I'm going to take a little bit of that brush and run it under to clean it up. On this uh, oh, 266 brush, just an angle brush, I'm going to take that Princess of China shade and put that in the center on the lash line. So that's that. Now I'm going to use the MAC Extended Play Lash Mascara on my bottom lashes. I'm going to use a little bit of mascara on the top lashes, just a little because we're going to be using false lashes. Oh, and I'm using a Maybelline mascara. And for lashes, I'm going to be using these. These are just wispies. And I'm going to be using my Duo Lash Glue. So now that our lashes are on, I'm going to take that e.l.f. Um, liner again. And I'm going to tight line. And I'll do this off camera. I just think it's weird looking at people put eyeliner into their waterline and tight line. I'm going to take a little bit of the e.l.f. Is this e.l.f.? I don't even know what this is. I think it's e.l.f. But it's a liquid liner in the shade black. I'm just going to use this to cover up the lash band in any spots where the glue didn't dry clear. Don't come for me in the comments y'all about the lashes. Um, or anything for that matter because I don't know what I'm doing. Lashes are really hard for me. I'm just learning because I used to never wear lashes. So moving on to the face, I'm going to, for my highlight, I'm going to be using Max Soft and Gentle, which looks like this. And I'm going to be using a Real Techniques setting brush. I absolutely love this brush for highlight.
Now moving on to blush, I'm going to take my favorite blush, which is Breath of Plum by MAC, and I'm going to use that on a 168 brush. Moving on to lips, I'm going to take NYX Lip Liner in the shade Brown and MAX Viva Glam 2, which is literally my favorite nude. So I'm just going to line my lips and fill them in. To lighten the center of my lips just a little bit, I'm going to take Myth by MAC. Now I'm going to set my set my face with the Urban Decay Makeup Setting Spray. So I'm just going to do that and I will show you guys the final look.